Um, can we run 100 octane with stage one or two 93 octane tune on B9 3.0T? Yes, absolutely. You can, yeah. It's so, uh, you know, like, like we talk about, um, there are tunes out there that for, for whatever reason, the calibrator couldn't properly program the maps. And so they, they continue to rely on the knock sensing safety uh, functionality within the ECU to pull timing back to supposedly a safer level. Uh, our tunes don't do that. We go and we remap the ignition timing maps so that the, the amount of correction that the ECU would do is minimal or simply to account for varying fuel qualities, varying octane levels, varying external conditions that would make the engine more sensitive to detonation. Um, but, but, you know, in, in regular normal conditions, there should be very, very little correction. Um, but if you put in a higher octane than what the tune is designed for, then, the, then you can pretty much uh, get some amount that the ECU will no longer have to correct ever because the octane is so high that there's no detonation to correct for. So that could be, you know, one or two degrees here and there, and you'll definitely gain that. Um, I would say maybe do a 50-50 mix or something. Um, filling it with 100, unless you just want to burn $8 a gallon gas, right. is probably not going to get you anything more than if you just bumped it up to, say, 95 or 96 octane. Yeah, it's it's a normal thing to do for some folks who are you know out here on 91. If you're doing a 100-degree plus track day, it's certainly a nice so, so safety feature to just add a gallon. That was the one thing I was going to say is where you will really notice it on any tune, even ours that's optimal, is on on track when you're really loading up the engine mm -hmm. you're really getting it warm um, then the extra octane uh, will help and i've noticed when i go to the track i'll i'll do like half a tank of 100 and um and you feel it the, the car feels stronger it feels smoother um and it's because of, you know that that higher octane fuel is able to deal with the additional heat and so the, the ecu won't have to pull things back yeah. as much um, so yeah, I mean, it's, it's, you're, you're definitely going to pay a price. Now you don't have to do it. You can do, if you want to put on our 91 or 93 octane tune and, and do full sessions on 91 or 93, you're going to be perfectly fine. Yeah. It'll be completely safe. It's just as heat continues to build, mm -hmm. there is more potential for knock, especially in a knock yeah. heavy fuel like 91. Yeah. Yeah. So no, it's, it's, it's a good idea and you can play with it. You know, you can do it. If you don't, if you don't notice it, then don't, you know, stop doing it. But I, I believe you'll notice it's just the the motor will just feel stronger and smoother and yeah. just more more happy. It just it just it won't necessarily give you like another fifty horsepower or anything exactly. like that. Yeah.